High school students from around Lethbridge had a chance to learn all about the duties of a police officer during the Youth Police Academy program. All the youth engagement officers are assigned a portfolio of schools and community partners to do with uh, anything to do with youth. Each year the LPS will work with administrators at different high schools and pull students who've expressed interest in policing and bring them out for an up-close and personal look at what the profession entails. Another big part is just using it as a recruiting tool as well too. Um, because they are coming to the age where they can decide uh, for post-secondary purposes if policing is something that they're going to be interested in. This batch of 16 students also had the opportunity to hear from different policing units, including the tactical team and explosive disposal unit. We see a bad guy, let's say he's up in the bedroom and he has a gun or something like that, we can push a, a button on here. Integrity and helping the community. Ever since he was a kid, grade 11 student Tayshawn Small Eye says he's had a dream of working in the police force. And once he's old enough, there will be no hesitation to apply to work for the LPS. I kind of want to get involved with the community here and kind of just help with the native population and of course everybody else, but just help whatever's going on here. As for grade 10 student Reese Lance, her interest is in forensics and by attending this program, it gave her a better outlook at what her future career would look like. You usually just see it on TV and all the shows and I thought it was really cool and I wanted to see what it was like to do it in real life and not in a movie, and not actually doing it. Constable Alistair Coop and recruiter with LPS says he took part in a similar program in Lacombe and he hopes some of the students will consider a career in policing after attending this program. As the, as the journey is important, the, the passion for this job that has continued even after 16 years is what I hope that these kids can see that this job is, is really meaningful over the long term. For Bridge City News, I'm Angela Stewart.